Make a clear path for the Lord to travel. Doing so will clear your paths of the snares that would hinder you from fulfilling your call to ministry. Find out how in Straight Path for the Lord. Available at tapepublishing.com. The Holy Bible says that we are all one body with many different parts where everyone has a role to play. Understand how God functions in meticulous order in Tenfold Ministry. Available at tatepublishing.com. Now, the thing you need to understand about Job is Job had contradictions in his life. He had things in his life. He had fear. He had pride in his life that kept him from having the most pure relationship with God. You don't believe me? I'll prove it in the scripture. Put the scripture up. Job 3, verse 25 and 26. For what I fear comes upon me, and what I dread befalls me. I am not at ease, nor am I quiet, and I am not at rest, but turmoil comes. Now you see the key word in that, in that line of scripture was fear. All my fears. Guess what? He feared that he, he he loved his kids so much. He feared that he would love. He feared that he would lose them. He feared that he would lose his rich. He feared all these things. He feared all all the things that he had taken away from. Him. That those were fears in his life. And guess what? The the scripture I put up before was showing you that God does. He loves you so much. He wants to get rid of all the fear out of your life. So you can have a full and open and, and purposeful relationship with God. See fear conquers it, 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 it negates all that God has done guess what faith comes by hearing the word of God fear comes by hearing the devil and those many voices that speak to you that are contrary to the word of God it's that simple if you want to make it black and white you want to make it simple and plain you got to understand that fear is the antagonist of faith that means it's the opposite of faith See, you as a person, you can have faith in fear. You can have more faith in, you can believe more in fear than you believe more in God. You can believe more in the world than you believe more in God's kingdom. You can believe more in the devil than you believe in Christ Jesus. You can believe that the devil is better than Jesus. You can believe all these things and it will, it, it, it will, it will actually make you, it will lead you, it will guide you down a path of unbelief. Fear leads to unbelief. You get that?